हेलो गाइस हाउ आर यू वेलकम टू आईओएस प्रो हैकर इन दिस वीडियो आई विल शो यू दैट हाउ यू कैन फिक्स प्रॉब्लम्स ऑन आईफोन आईपैड एंड आईपॉड टच If you are an iPhone user, you may experience these kinds of issues with your iPhone. Your iPhone may stuck on Apple logo, black screen, frozen screen, recovery mode, white screen, stuck on update, loading bar, stuck on disabled screen, stuck on headphone mode, stuck on boot loop, stuck on won't restore or won't backup screen, blue screen and stuck at iTunes logo screen. If you are facing any kind of issue with your iPhone, iPad or iPod Touch, so you are at the right place. Because in today's video, I will guide you the method to fix your iOS devices without losing your important data. So let's start the tutorial. If your iPhone is showing this type of screen, It means your iPhone is stuck at recovery mode. It mostly happens while updating or restoring the iOS device. To fix it, you need a computer and need to download the software called ReiBot. You can Google it or visit the link in the description of this video. Do not worry, this software is absolutely 100% free and will fix your iOS devices in just a click without losing the data. Once you install it in your computer, open it up. Connect your iOS device with the computer now. Now on the computer, you will see the exit recovery mode button on the software. Just tap on it to get your iOS device fixed instantly. Once you tap it, your iPhone will reboot to the normal mode. This is how you can fix your iPhone if it is stuck at recovery mode. Simple. If you have tried fixing your iOS device with the previous trick and it is not working for you, now let me show you the second trick to fix your iOS devices. This trick will fix any kind of iOS problems without losing the data. It's one click process and very easy to do. All you need is to download and install the iTunes in your computer. You can visit the link in the description of this video to download iTunes. Once iTunes installed, open it up and connect the iOS device to the computer. After you connect your iOS device, the computer may not detect your iPhone. You have to first put your iPhone into the recovery mode. Different iPhone models have different methods to put the phone into the recovery mode. If you have an iPhone 8 or newer devices like iPhone 10, iPhone XS, iPhone XR or iPhone 11, you have to follow these steps to put the iPhone into the recovery mode. If you have an iPhone 7 or a 7 Plus, you have to follow these steps to put the iPhone into the recovery mode. If you have an older iPhone than iPhone 7 such as iPhone 6S, iPhone 6, 5s, 5, 4s or iPhone 4, you have to follow these steps to put the phone into the recovery mode. If you have an iPad or iPod, please check the description of the video for a guide to put that into the recovery mode. Once you put your iPhone into the recovery mode, your iPhone will stuck on this computer screen or you may see the iTunes logo if you have an older iPhone iOS versions. So once you see this screen on the iPhone, the computer will detect your iOS device and your iOS device will show up on the iTunes. Now here, you need to tap on the update button to start fixing your iPhone without losing the data. Now the iTunes will going to download the iOS firmware package before fixing the iPhone. Once the iOS firmware package will download completely, iTunes will start fixing your iOS device. Simple is that. The iTunes will completely fix your iOS devices. 
these are the two simple methods to get your iOS device fixed. Are you still having the problems? Is the iTunes not working for you? Are you having any kind of errors while using the iTunes? No problem. Download and install Tenor Share Re iBoot in your PC. This tool is available in Windows and Mac both. This is the best alternative tool of iTunes for fixing iOS devices issues. Now open Re iBoot. Tap on the Repair Operating System. Now tap on the Fix Now button. Now as always, you have to put your iPhone into the recovery mode after connecting your phone to the computer. Choose your phone model here and follow the steps given here which will help you to fix your iPhone into the recovery mode. Once you enter your iPhone into the recovery mode, now tap on the download button to download the iOS firmware package. Now you need to wait for it to complete the downloading process. Make sure you have a good internet connection. Once the download will complete, the re iBoot will start fixing your iOS device. It normally takes 5 minutes to complete the process. So this will fix every kind of issue which you are having with your iOS device. Use this re iBoot if the iTunes is not working for you. I hope this method for fixing the iPhone will work for you. See you later in the next video. Have a good day. Do not forget to support me at Patreon or join my YouTube membership.